Hey guys, and welcome back. Hope you guys are ready for another week of Instagram stories. I'm literally right now, you know, just finished uploading the whole situation, you know, from my phone to there. And now I'm um, just recording the intro so that you guys can enjoy this fully to its maximum awesomeness. So anyways, if you guys have the first time you guys ever see this, I literally just record my Instagram stories and I put them on the YouTube thingy so you guys can watch them, you know, in case you miss them. Also, I got to figure out a better way how to do this because I'm guessing that these things are not going to be in order again. So I think I'm going to have to do this daily and then accumulate them. Anyways, personal side note for me, the editor. <laughs> so, all right, without further ado, enjoy the show. out here working you already know So yeah, I came out here to Walmart because I had to pick up a few things and uh, I bumped into this guy that looked exactly like a white guy from America. And sure enough, he was. Made a new friend out here. Name is John. Pretty cool, huh? Talking, um, I asked him straight up, hey, uh, do you speak any Spanish? He's like, no, I speak zero Spanish. So now I got my answer. You can survive out here without speaking any Spanish. So yeah, just a uh, shout out to all you guys asking me that question. No, that's not a crime scene. It's laundry day. By the way, how do I know when it's laundry day? I run out of underwear. I'm gonna go hang it over there. And we have round three. Look at that. Wife beaters as far as I can see. What is this, a fucking prison? <laughs> so uh, my day continues. I'm on my way to a friend's house right now. So I gotta go pick up a new project that I gotta work on and uh, I'm probably gonna start working on it tonight and see if I can finish it soon. A little bit of a side note. Um, just wanna say thanks to all you guys out there that are watching these Instagram stories, whether they're here or on YouTube. Regardless, it really seems like you guys love these a lot, so, well, I'm gonna keep making them. Deal with it. All right, uh, just got the USBs. On my way back home and uh, about to get started in a little bit. Well, time for a break while I wait. Well, not bad for a Saturday. I already did all my laundry, uh, paid rent, went to go pick up a new job, did a bunch of little chores, taking a little break and uh, back to work. For now, the plan is to just stay home and do some work and work through the night. Um, hopefully a uh, senorita hits me up from Tinder and I uh, got a reason to go out. But otherwise, you know, just got to grind. Grind, grind, grind. All right. No Tinder date just yet, but um, I do have a few prospects for maybe maybe later tonight. So 
In the meantime, I'm going to be working and I'm cooking dinner. I got some potatoes I'm frying up, cooking some onions over here, and this thing over here. And uh, what I'm going to be making today is uh, tortilla española. And that's just a big egg and potato and onion omelet that is very typical to Spain. It's awesome. Alright, so now I beat some, some eggs, got the potatoes, got the cooked onions down there, and we're just going to mix them together. That's it. So that's it. Now I mix it, I cover it, and I hold it for a little while until it's ready to cook. So you know, I let it sit for a little while and it all melt together, and then later on you'll see the, you'll see the end result. All right, so we got first step, all right, which is just pouring it all in there, and then we'll flip it again, and we'll have a ginormous potato omelet. And here it is after it's flipped. It smells so good. And there's the finished product. Ta-da! Then we got some black beans. Doing some, you know, work. Chips. Yummy in the tummy. Alright guys, so why am I showing you this? Well, because I'm always showing you guys stuff about like Gary Vee and all that good stuff. Hustle. What is hustle? Well, again, I don't know if you guys can hear in the background. But there's shit going on. I live again. Where do I live? You know, right next to all the fun stuff, you know, all the cool stuff. But again, it's all about getting work done. You know what I mean? I could be out there spending money and doing all kinds of frivolous stuff. But no, I'm out here, you know, being having a humble meal, you know, getting some work done and so on and so forth. Sure, if I get lucky and a friend hits me up, you know, or I get a Tinder day, you know, just wants to, okay, great. You know, we'll have some fun. I guess I'll have fun. You know what I'm saying? But otherwise, you know, why go and do anything that's not productive? Okay, so anyways, with that being said, thank you so much for joining me today. This is Saturday night, and uh, well, I'm going to see you guys Sunday, and uh, I'm going to put this whole thing together so you guys can watch it later. Thanks for watching. Peace. A little bit of a slow start today, but eh, got one project down, two to go. It is Lazy Sunday after all, but again, just back to that grind, that's all. You know, maybe next weekend if I don't have that many projects and stuff like that, and I do take care of <clears throat> a lot more of my work, then I can go out and have fun in town. But for now, gotta work. Happy April Fools guys. Hope everybody's having a fun and beautiful Monday and not getting tricked too much. <laughs> Doing more of the tricking and less of the falling for those tricks, right? Well anyways, just wanted to post something. Just wanted to let you guys know I apologize for falling off the Instagram story wagon. <laughs> I've been actually pretty busy. If you've seen my last two or three posts or whatever, I've been pretty busy. A lot of projects. A lot of them do. I know why you guys are really here, and it's not because of me and my wife Peter. It's because of this guy. <laughs> this guy right here. Help me. What'd you say? All right. Lucky you guys, and uh, well, lucky me. I gotta go to the store to go pick up a wire transfer. So, um, all right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm gonna be taking my camera with me. I don't know if you guys can see it. There. Strapping it to my head. All right, so I already got my money. Um, I walked over here, filmed a little bit. Now I'm here at Walmart. I'm gonna pick up a couple things and uh, head back. I'll film. I'll, make, I'll see if I can post a picture or two or something.
Yeah, so living on the West Coast, you know, prepared me for a day like this. You know, well, actually, it's every day I come here, but, you know, when I get my groceries, I put them in my bag and, and I walk home. All right, well, I'm on my way back. I was able to fit everything in one bag. FBI.me. I filmed on the way over here, so I'm just going to listen to a podcast on the way back. Going to get my learning on, right? Woo, fucking hot and humid out here today. Anyways, I uh, just finished filming the episode and uh, got Lambo over there. He, he's, he's hot, so he's hanging out by the windows, you guys can see. But anyways, that's what I'm up to. Gotta edit that shit, and then as soon as I finish editing it, I gotta roll a few blunts, go upstairs, take a shower, get ready, because we're going live tonight on Twitch, like we do every Monday and Thursday night. Check your local listings for more schedule. So yeah, you guys are probably wondering, wait a minute, weren't you already with a camera strapped to your head and went to go film something earlier today and now you film something else? What gives, bro? Well, again, I do daily uploads. And in order for me to do daily uploads, that means that I gotta have these videos ready whether I like to or not. So this week, I have a lot of work, a lot of projects. Have you guys seen? You know, you guys have only seen it like a little bit, but there's more of that coming. And um, I need to make time for that. So right now, I just filmed two episodes, whether I'm gonna edit one for tomorrow and maybe the other one I won't edit till tomorrow or whatever. But the point is that I got content always there. Why? Because I'm thinking about you guys first, more than anything. You guys are first. Then him. Well, just out here doing my Twitch show like I do every night. So that, that's where we are. Now, Say hi to everybody. And uh, that's it. I'm going to keep doing this, uh, get some tacos later and go to bed. Uh, just waking up. Uh, let me check the Bitcoin price. Oh, shit. What? Ah! Yeah, obviously, um, for all you Bitcoin crypto enthusiasts out there, good night. All right, so now that I woke up and I saw Bitcoin's price go up so fucking high, I can afford a shirt. I can finally afford a shirt. So, you know, decided to class it up a little bit and uh, put a shirt on. <laughs> All right. So I literally, I still got to do this one. I have this one. I got this one. Plus, I got another one that just came in. So I got one, two, three, four, pending four. All right. Let's see where we're at. So yeah, it works so much that the computer needs to take a break. It gets so freaking hot that it needs to take a break. So this is how I cool it down, see? I need to get a fan, but that's later on. And this is why I love it out here, because even though it is 95 degrees, it's not crazy humid. It's not humid like in Miami. So 95 degrees in Miami will be like 158,000 degrees. Here, 95 degrees is 95 degrees. Sure, it's hot. But again, I come from, you know, the swamp. Um, I've lived in the desert where it's 125, 125. And um, I worked in kitchens for like my whole life, which is always like a million degrees. So, you know, this is nice. All right. Long day. I already finished two whole videos. Uh, retouched another one. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to take a little bit of a break. All right, break time. Then I gotta cook some dinner. Then I gotta take a shower. And then I gotta edit another video tonight. Go for the trifecta. I know I can do it. I believe in me. Well, I got some mushrooms, some onions, and a bunch of other stuff. I was cleaning up the fridge. And some chicken. And I'm gonna eat that with some of that. Some quinoa's. You want? All right, yeah, so <clears throat> I got to go to the store real quick because I got a little message that said, hey, you got to pay your phone bill or you got no more phone bill. So yeah, it's like a prepaid phone. That's how it works out here. 10 pesos a month. I mean, 10 pesos a day. So that's 300 pesos a month. 
So that comes out to $15 a month for everything included. Not bad, huh? All right, let's see if this works. All right, uh, because I had no phone signal and uh, I just paid my phone bill about two seconds ago. Let's see if uh, this uploads. So did you see that? Someone just opened up their house and they're selling tacos out of their house. I was like, fuck, man. I'm already cooking something at home. Otherwise, I would uh, probably would have eaten their dinner at that lady's house. Well, next time. morning how's everybody doing out there happy 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 hump day and meffers all right i gotta get to work i'm already a little late been busy all morning and um i'll see you guys in a bit so on today's docket um i'm gonna be wearing a shirt i promise because i gotta go live in a little bit but uh anyways i gotta go live i gotta finish editing one more video i was able to you know knock two out yesterday and work on a third so just finish another one today and then once i finish that video uh, i mean once i finish my live stream gotta work on that video and then i gotta edit also tomorrow's video so i got you know three things i gotta do today not bad i think i'll be able to get everything done before nightfall i hope hey guys well i just finished my live stream a few minutes ago um, and I was going to do a little video while I was doing that video, you know, double live stream, double whatever. But um, literally, um, I got in such a heated discussion today with um, some of my viewers and so on and so forth, you know, talking about crypto, XRP, state of the world, so many things. It was actually super fun. And the two hours just disappeared like that. Speaking of which, I got to get to work. I got a lot of projects due. So All right, guys. Well, listen, I know it's not even spring summer yet i think it is but right now it's 95 degrees i have to go back to my wife beater you're going to be seeing a lot of this moving forward because it's just so hot today it's 95 so now uh, how the water system really works out here is that all these things are always up on the roof and uh gravity is what usually takes its place you know as to how it so again you know the water is put up there when you turn on the water the gravity, the flow comes all the way down through the bottom and then that allows the water pressure and all these things to take place. So yeah, you know, that's how things work out here. That's another reason why things are cheaper out here. Degrees again, only this time there's like 100% humidity. So it feels just like Miami. So it's just fucking terrible. All right, well, let's continue with this real quick. So I gotta go outside real quick because I gotta refill the water. What, what do you mean refill the water? Well, I don't know if you guys can see up there but you see back there I got these two big water tanks and if you see other houses around you see there's water black water tanks and uh, here's the sink but uh so when people say don't drink the water again I don't I never drank the water back in the States here they bring you water this is 30 pesos they bring it to your door it's a dollar fifty there there and pretty much everyone out here in Mexico has some sort of situation like this. So what I do is that every few days I come out here to my backyard. Besides to get some sun. I come out. Anyways, back to what I was saying. It's hot. It's humid. It's kind of sucky out here today. Sometimes it gets humid out here. But it's not always. Back in Florida, it was 24 hours a day. It's 365 days a year. Here, it's nice. Here, and I have the switch here. I click that switch. And bam, I pump water. Now, where am I pumping water from? I think it's from underground. I'm pretty sure it's from underground. So I got like this whole system here. So let's just talk about the water issue real quick. Because people always ask me, it's like, do you drink the water from here? And again, just to reiterate, I, I don't. Who does? And, and the same in the United States of America. I never drank the water from there either. I always had to figure out a way to get water like this. I don't know if you guys can see there. And um, that system gets the water from the underground, it pumps it through this whole system, and eventually it makes it all the way up there. Now, how it also works is that... Um, Alright, so we got round two. 
By the way, this is straight up fucking espresso, okay? No, no drip coffee here. No drip, drip. I literally make one of these big ass boys, all right? Pure Cuban espresso coffee. Fuck yeah. So now, first thing on the docket after I did my live stream today, plus a bunch of other crap. What time is it? Is it 2.15 p.m.? So now, um, I got to do tomorrow's episode, and then I got to work on my client and then that's it so if you guys have ever heard of that saying that says if you do what you love you'll never work a day in your life well that's kind of like what i do i really do what i love so sure if you literally follow me every single day you see that my days are jam packed to the brim wall to wall never balls to the wall you know what i mean never stopping doing all kinds of shit. but again i love what i do so I am enjoying everything that I do. This is all fun in comparison. All right, so let's go through this. I already finished this one. Still working on the Johnny project. I already finished Marissa up here. I still have to finish Steph's project. And I'm about to work on the vlog now. Into what could be. Meaning working a nine to five or doing projects I don't want to do. Having things, you know, again, I have full control i just happen to also be a little bit of a workaholic so it kind of all works out this johnny project i've been working on four months i really can't wait to finish it and show you guys but anyway so here's a look at the vlog that's tomorrow's vlog walking and talking around mexico your favorite okay so just finished uploading tomorrow's video now i gotta get to work on the next video I've actually been kind of busy. Um, today's episode what I did, I did live. I was talking a lot about XRP and all that good stuff and had a bunch of trolls come after me. Fun times. So yeah, another really cool thing about having that water situation up on the roof and stuff like that is the fact that when it comes to taking a shower, I got hot water already. I don't need to turn on the water heater because it's on those big black metal jugs and it gets heated up during the whole day and bam, there you go. Yeah, so today it's uh, Thursday, and I gotta get going to El Centro, to the market. Got a bunch of things I gotta do. I'm still trying to figure out how, what order I'm gonna do these things in, because I have a lot of work I gotta also do, and I'm just trying to figure out if I should get to work first, or go to the center first. I don't know. Anyways, you guys will find out. It's a beautiful morning. Oh yeah. I've decided to stay home and do some work first. I know myself and if I leave right now, I'm gonna be extremely distracted and uh, procrastinate a lot and start filming and having all this fun and not really doing work. Let me do the work and then I can have fun and go out. I know myself, but before I do anything, I need to take care of this thing I think it's uh, gonna be haircut time soon I might I'm gonna let it grow a little longer but I'm gonna be getting a haircut soon as you already know it's almost summer I think <laughs> I know horrible anyways uh, I, I just also realized I'm in Mexico and uh, the one thing you do need to know about out here is that things don't necessarily open on time they close late everything really does close late out here for the most part but they don't open on time which is kind of weird because you'll look on Google Maps or all, the, all these places and, uh, you know, you'll see like a time and then it won't necessarily be open on that time exactly. So it's still early. <laughs> Crap. I'm trying to do some shit here, some magic, because I think I lost one of the projects I'm working on. Stupid updates. Thank God. Oof. Oof. Crisis averted. Literally spent like half an hour trying to fix this. Uh, the whole program updated. The editing program updated. And so every time I open a new program, it's, uh, you know what I mean? It just like changes it so that it's for the new update. 
So I've never had a problem or anytime this does, you know, that, that happens. But all of a sudden, you know, I, I was trying to open this project up and it kept freezing and freezing. But thank God. Oof. We're back. Man, seriously, that shit really fucking sucked, man. I'm so fucking glad I was able to figure it out. Then gotta have technology know-how. I literally got all the files, put them in a brand new folder, tricked the computer into fucking whatever. Anyways, it worked. Thank God. See, look, that's another thing about being an entrepreneur. You gotta do everything. So, I was tech support. <laughs> Alright, but anyways, good job, tech support. Proud of you. All right, guys, you already know what time it is. I gotta get going to the store, go to the Centro, buy a few things, and head back. Um, finished all the projects, I got time to kill, so you gotta maximize your time. I really don't wanna go out, it's hot and humid out there. Yesterday, I had somebody tell me, hey, you should make another one of your motivational videos. I love when you make those, you don't make those as much as anymore. Well, guess what, that's what we're kinda doing today because I'm trying to motivate myself, so in turn, you're gonna turn into a video. Let's do this. Alright, I just finished uh, recording an episode, I just finished uh, doing some shopping out here in the Centro, 4 o'clock p.m. I'm on my way back and um, I gotta do a live show later tonight. Always jam-packed, always doing shit. long day well i'm finishing up the upload here just a couple more minutes so i can close the computer go upstairs and take a quick shower and then come right back downstairs and do my live stream on twitch yep yeah literally i want to wait for the upload to finish so i can turn off the computer so i can cool down so it you know won't overheat too much because again i gotta overuse it later tonight um but yeah i mean i don't know if you saw earlier it's like literally 100 degrees so it's hot come on Hurry up. Ah. You're killing me, Smalls. I can realize, you know, I haven't done my Instagram stories all day today. But anyways, yeah, it's already late as fuck. I'm getting ready to eat, so I'm going to heat up some of that leftover chicken that I had from the other night. Eat some, some of this UFO soup. You know, hang out with my buddies a little longer online. Uh, say hi. Hi. And uh, and then that's it. Call it a night. And uh, that's Thursday night. How many nights have we done already? Done a full week and then some. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, yeah, I'm still working. I'm literally transferring files from here to here. So with that being said, this is the last shot that you're going to see out of the Instagram stories. It's Friday night, and I think we started in the weekend. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And... Um, well, stay tuned for more. I'm definitely going to be keep, keep doing these every week. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, good morning, guys. Happy Friday. Hey, last night I had some of this alcohol here. By the way, so this bottle cost around uh, five U.S. dollars, give or take. And um, so the reason I bought this was because didn't have my brand uh, that I usually buy, so I was like, ah, fuck it, let me try this out. I bought this shit a few weeks ago. I don't know if you guys remember, but like, um, I had like a really bad hangover a couple weeks ago, and I couldn't remember why I had such a bad hangover, per se. And I really couldn't get myself to drink for a while. Um, so anyways, I finally had a few drinks last night where I was doing the live feed, having fun, we were all chilling. You know, again, that's why I forgot to do some of these videos. We were just having such a fun time. And uh, I wake up this morning and I'm like all fucked up again. And I only had a few and I'm like, fuck, man. I think it's just really shitty whiskey. So note to self, don't buy this brand again. Real neck at the gads right here. The gas guy is here. That's what's the noise. Literally. See that right there when you see like set that set that that noise that song and you hear it all the time it's a gas guy so they just go all around the neighborhoods singing their song 
and then uh, when you hear it, you're gonna come out and they refill your gas tank. You know, ever since I moved out here, people kept telling me like around April and May, which is this month and next month, are usually like the hottest, the hottest around here. And I moved out here like June, July, you know, June, you know, that's when I really got out here. And um, it was pretty crazy because I just figured, nah, it can't get any hotter than June and then like, you know, August, September, all that shit. But man, yesterday was crazy hot. Um, when it gets hot in the last couple of days, it's been insanely hot. It's been pretty freaking hot today as balls and humid. And I'm not looking forward to the next couple months. Uh, hopefully June gets here quick because I remember June was actually pretty nice. It was hot as balls, but not like this. Anyways, the reason I know it's not good hot is because it feels heavy. The air feels heavy. That's how I know this shit sucks and it's humid because that's how it feels in Miami. Just sticky and nasty. Right now I'm just chilling with my horse, you know, just hanging out here trying to stay out of the sun for a bit. But I'm about to go out in a little bit. Literally, I haven't left the house yet because I'm just waiting for the sun to go down because it's, you know, pretty bad out there. So probably in another hour. So yeah, um, it's 100 degrees, feels like over 100 or whatever I said there. It's hot, it really is hot. And um, yeah, I'm out here and I can tell you, um, it really is hot. Well, I'm um, just walking to the store now. Got my trusty camera. Uh, I'm about to start filming another episode and uh, you already know, I'm just, I wish I had more hands. I need assistance. I need I need help. When I say when I say I need help, I really just mean I need mental help. <laughs> That's pretty much it. All right, all right. Enough uh, enough chit chat. I gotta start recording on this fucking thing. All right, let me cross the street, make sure I don't get killed. As you guys know, it's my weakness. So I'm at Walmart, my favorite place on earth. As I was recording today's episode, fuck, I'm hot. Look at that shit. It's a lot of sweat. <laughs> Anyways, uh, my camera kept turning off because it was so hot. <laughs> it couldn't handle it. I think it was what I was saying. It was just too hot to handle. And uh, you know how fucking hot it is right now that I actually came in here expecting some cold AC and the AC ain't as cold as it normally is. That's how you know it's fucking hot as fuck in here. So, uh, you know, out here, period. Oh, I think I just realized why it's so fucking hot in here. And as you notice, look, no music. The power just went out a few minutes ago. I think that it's so hot that they're cranking the AC all the way to full power for the first time in, you know, like the year, and yeah. So now we're gonna play this game that I love to call Walmart Tetris. So I gotta fit up all my fucking groceries into this little bag, into this. That, that also helps with the shopping in the sense of like, you know, I can only shop as much as I can carry or else. All right, you see the bag back there. We got this one, tight fit, but we got it. All right, so now plug in my headphones and gotta rock it back all the way back to the crib. All right, let's do this. All right, I got it all. I got my backpack full. I got this full. Now we got to trek home. Tight fit, but we got it all in there. That's what she said. All right, I'll see you guys uh, on the flip side. It's fucking hot as balls in here. All right, so I just got home and the power is out. My friends tell me that it's out all over the place. So it's out all over the Yucatan Peninsula. That explains what happened at Walmart. Man, this sucks. This is gonna be a last message for a while because I gotta charge my phone. Well, save charge. All right, I just talked to some friends and uh, they just told me that um, they got power back in some locations, not everywhere, but it's peninsula wide, meaning it's, it's everywhere, all the way from Cancun to Campeche, you know, like the whole Yucatan Peninsula is without power. So that's extremely intuitive thing about this whole thing. So, all right, without further ado, I'll see you guys in a little while, all right? Um, wish me luck, all right? Send some power, you know, uh, say a wish to the power fairies, all right? And hopefully I get some power back. All right, later. Power. So this is going to be the last um, thing for a while because I got to save power on my phone. I, you know, I got 40%. So I'm just going to take a shower, smoke a blunt, and enjoy paradise. Uh, you know, that's the one positive. All right, update. We got the power back on. But now my friend has no power. <laughs> Good thing I took a shower and I'm just charging my phone and I'm um, just preparing, you know, to see what the night brings us. Um, hopefully it's not going to get too bad and hopefully um, 
there will be power tonight and uh, this just won't be too much of a serious situation but I mean I got a lot of work to do but at the same time it's like I don't even want to you know be playing around with my electronic equipment with um, the power coming on and coming off and all that good stuff so I'm just gonna go smoke a blunt enjoy nature for a little bit and um, and hope for the best all right so I'll see you guys later and uh, hopefully this won't be the last message of tonight um, later well the power is kind of back on ish you know so i'm kind of playing it safe and just chilling out and maybe i'll just chill out tonight and will not work much since that's all i ever fucking do maybe it's the universe also telling me to take a fucking break for a minute so that's kind of like what i'm gonna do i have a lot of friends that are you know chatting with me i got a lot of other you know personal things that i should be doing and uh you know i got lambo over here you know getting getting a little jelly jelly so i'm just gonna you know do that spend some time with the fam and uh and go from there i might be able to do some work later tonight but at this rate i think i'm just gonna go with the flow and uh maybe i'll go out i don't know we'll see we'll find out together anyways thanks for joining me through this uh electrical crisis look you see the flickering of the light that's not good man anyways i got my computer unplugged and i think i'm gonna remain unplugged for the rest of the night <laughs> Okay, the lights stopped flickering. We got, you know, constant power. So I started panicking because I wasn't working. And I realized I didn't have a video for tomorrow. And so, yeah, I'm back at it. Sorry. Yeah, I don't even know how this works anymore. I'm having extreme difficulty trying to figure out how to make this come out in order. It's something about the files being saved in the phone. Anyways, listen, I'm sorry. I really want this thing to come out in order. I'm trying my best. Just don't yell at me. Lambo already yells at me. Speaking of which, I gotta get going. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share. Please hit that bell icon. I drop videos every day, all kinds of content. I really hope you enjoyed this. And uh, just thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And uh, again, I'm sorry about the mishmash. I hope it did come out, come out in order. All right, whatever. I'm out. Peace. Enjoy. Well, you already did enjoy. See you tomorrow.